Antonio has a whip. It strikes out both sides. So the number of like strikes is increased by how many projectiles you have. So I start with a bonus projectile uh, from my passive tree. Uh, it evolves into the bloody tear, and I'll show you the evolution in a little bit. That'll be the first thing I go for. The uh, laurel's going to go well with it. It gives you a damage reduction. So the main thing we're looking for is the hollow heart to upgrade the whip, because that's the first evolution I'm going to be going for. God, these things are really weird. They're like Easter Island heads if you made an Easter Island head of a tree. The treants. God, I love this game. I've been playing it so much. <laughs> oh, there's a boss here. Never mind. That's I'm going to do for it. I might try to go for the storm ring as my last weapon. Because it gives bonus projectiles. Ooh. Awesome. Ooh, stone mask. Nice. If I hit discard, does it leave it here or does it just destroy it? Oh, it destroys it. I'm still going to go to the right to get the power-ups, but I want to get all this juke XP. This, this game is like... It's so satisfying. It looks so simple, but it's really satisfying. Like, they actually... They managed to make something that's, like... A lot better than I than like I feel like it should be just based on its graphics alone, but like it's it's really good. Ooh, coffin! Oh my god! What is this? What have I found? I really like whatever's in there. Okay, thanks. You just like die for me? That'd be nice. Oh, for anyone who's, like, super confused, I am intentionally avoiding the treasure chest. That's not an accident. Because the treasure chests have the ability to give you the weapon evolutions. And the only way I can evolve my whip is if I get the hollow heart first. I'm hoping that the next level up will give me the hollow heart, then I can take the treasure chest immediately, level it up, and then I will be just, like, super powerful. Okay, the duplicator is good, because that, that is what I need to upgrade the lightning ring and to, um, to evolve it, and it'll also give me another projectile for my wand. Or my wand, my whip. And my whip has, like, super whippy. No! Damn it! Give me the hollow heart! <laughs> I need it! Well, I completely forgot that I was actually trying to kill this guy over here. The problem is that he's in, like, a really bad spot. Oh, there we go. There we go! What the fuck? Giovanna Grana joins the survivors. Okay, so that is another character I've unlocked. That's nice. Hollow Heart! Okay! This is what the whip does. It becomes the bloody tear. And deal critical damage and absorbs HP. Now I have like some actually really strong lifesteal. So this will make my life a whole lot easier now. Die bat die. Super bat, you have no power here. Ooh! Oh! Oh my gosh! Quintuple chest! That's awesome. That's almost a thousand gold. When you go off screen from an area where, like, candelabras are likely to spawn, they, they, I don't know what, like, how long it takes, but they do respawn. So you can kind of, like, walk back and forth between two areas where candelabras spawn, and then you can just, like, keep breaking them with power-ups. Wow, there's so much stuff over here! Awesome! There's so much XP that the pickup thing could not pick it all up. And now I'm gonna fuse something. Okay, the frost has been fused. Frost becomes the Heaven Sword. It is the sword thing there. It's actually really cool.
Okay, the Thunder Loop is my favorite, like one of my favorites, if not my favorite, of all of the weapon evolutions. Chain Lightning. It's like mass chain lightning. I love it. So much XP. Can't pick up all the XP. I know there's just so much. It's overwhelming at times. This is the upgrade to the King Bible. The Unholy Vespers. Okay. King Bible ends. And Unholy Vespers. It's basically the King Bible, except for the projectiles never go away. Also, the Unholy Vespers and the King Bible, or especially the Unholy Vespers, are really good at destroying projectiles. Just because, like, a projectile can't get through that ring without being hit, and that ring will instantly destroy any projectiles. I'm not used to having all my weapons fused by this point. Not even 20 minutes in yet. Ooh! Is this a quintuple again? Oh yeah. Oh, triple hollow heart. That gives me another 60% max health and another 40% pickup range. Ooh. Hello. Hello, friend. Okay, between the King Bible, the Bloody Tear, and the Clock Lancet, like, nothing can touch me. I just realized during this round that if I hit spacebar, it automatically accepts the level up with whatever you're you highlighted, which in this case is just the first option, which is just to get more money. Would you like to watch me walk left? I hope so, because <laughs> I'm walking left. Oh, always picks the rest of the run. Oh, that probably makes it much easier. Uh, just in case, I'm gonna pick the four chicken, because I don't care about the gold. And now we take our hands off the keyboard. Damn it, I have to touch the keyboard. <laughs> or do I? Yes, I do. I don't want to get eaten by Medusa. I wonder if, like... Hiding someplace like here actually makes me more secure because things can't come in from north. This is getting a bit much. Uh. Uh. Medusa! Go away! No! Leave me alone! No! Turn to sender! The clock lancet is doing so much work. Everything that's turned blue is because the clock lancet is protecting me. All that stuff's frozen. Okay, another boss somewhere. Oh. Oh no. Oh no, this is the time when all the bosses come. I forgot. Okay, so everything is a boss now. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. 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 Uh. Uh. Just survive 30 more seconds. Uh. No. Alone. Restraining order. I have a restraining order is specifically against trains. And whatever the fuck the green things are. No. 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 Every time I level up, I'm getting more health. Oh. And done. And that is the Grim Reaper that I don't know if you can kill or not. Clockwork Lancet, do something. I don't like. I don't know if I can kill him or not, so I'm just gonna keep. Okay, that's really rude. Okay, if I can kill one, I certainly can't do it while another one is on me. <laughs> that was Antonio. He's pretty fun to play, even though he's the basic character. Like all the characters are really.